This is in my short breakout videos on problems. And so right now, right, I had 25 start, but then I find out that it's actually 26 is on course. So that's 20, so I have the wrong person on course. Well, I know that that's actually supposed to be 26. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to swap with the start. And now I've got 26 on course like they should be. And the starter assures me that I've got 27 is the next person who is in the gate. So that's now I've got the correct person on course. So let's go through and do this again. So uh, right now, the next thing is I just said 25. I, I sort of botched 25. So now the starter assures me that I've got 27 on course. And then I send, and so 27 goes, and then 28 goes, but then I'm having some bad communication with the starter. The starter goes, no, 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 that wasn't 28 that went, that was actually 25 that went. Well, that's okay. I put 25 up here in the gate. I click on 28. I swap with the start. And so now 25 was actually the person that he sent, which is good. And then the racer, and now the starter assures me we're 100% clear now that he's got 28 in the gate. So now I send 28. So if you realize that you've got the wrong person on course, you can do something about it. And it, and it doesn't have to be the, the very first person. So I can add in a couple of people on course. And this isn't a realistic situation, but that's okay. And now 29 is actually bib 15. I don't know why 29 is supposed to be bib 15, but that's okay. Um, I'm going to put 15 in the gate. I'm going to click on 29. I'm going to swap with the start. And now I have made 29 was not 29. 29 was 15. So now I have made the correct order of who's on course. Not a very real. The first few, the first few examples were realistic. This one was not really realistic, but I just want you to see what you can do in terms of changing who is on course by using the swap with start menu feature.